All right, this is going to be a video on uh, just a general securement and how to use the e-straps. Uh, first one we have just the traditional e-strap. And how you want to do it, you want to put the latch side in first and then bring it down and make sure it's locked in like that. Put the latch side first. And you want to use the ratchet strap. You want to pull it remotely pretty tight and then go ahead and ratchet it in. If you get it as tight as you want, you want to make sure you lock the handle back down. And then release it. Just pull back on the lock. And then go around to the latch, undo the latch, the bottom first, and then undo it there. When you actually have, are loading a trailer with a load in the trailer, you always want to make sure you have the low center of gravity as possible, the weight being toward the bottom. And the best thing to do is using load bars to prevent the load from shifting front and rear. We have a load bar back here, and then we can install a load bar on the front as well to prevent it from shifting forward and back. And by doing that, just take the load bar, set it down there first, and pull it across to the other side. And there's a latch here, just go in until it's locked in. And if you get it up against the pallet, that'll prevent it from sliding forward and back. Then to undo the load bar, push down, lift it out, go around to the other side of the same. Like that. And you also want to prevent the load from shifting left and right. And how we would do that would be using these straps. By securing them to the wall. Across both ways and then ratcheting it down tight so it prevents it from shifting left and right. And for loads that are irregular and not normal, we do have other E-straps that have hooks or the E-strap is the option. So you can E-strap it to the wall and then you have a hook to secure it to the item to pull down on a certain particular point if there was a tie down here. And we also have E-straps that have just a hook on one end and the e-strap on the other for the same reason. So you can have multiple different tie downs and secure it. And for something not as simple as a box sitting, like something like a round item sitting up against the wall, you can secure it right to the wall by using the e-strap taking it around right back to the other side. And then you want to ratchet it tight. Just like that. So it's secured, does not go forward, back, shift left or right. 